Are right, you ready? Boiling water, apply. Here we go, boys. I just want to see what happens. It doesn't seem like anything's happening. Oh! Oh, it's actually melting! What is going on, everybody? I am Brandon, aka the Frustrated Gamer, and welcome back to Floating Sandbox. So if you missed it last week, I became Thanos, and with one snap of my finger, I destroyed the entire Titanic in a matter of seconds. It was actually really, really funny, so definitely go back and check out that video if you haven't seen it yet. But you guys helped me out in the comment section, like you normally do, and you introduced me to the settings feature. Now, I didn't know any of this existed before. I can't believe I didn't. But this opens up so many new things you can do in the game. I can adjust the air temperature. I can adjust the water temperature. I can change the depth of the ocean. Like, look at this. If I make it super shallow and I go apply, boom, I feel like at this. <laughs> Like, the ocean's basically gone. There's a bunch of different amazing settings I can do. I think I could change the... Yeah, I could change the way the water looks. I could change the ground. I could change the sky. There's a bunch of awesome different things. The wind. I mean, I'm learning things right now as I'm doing this video. Uh, so today, guys... We're going to have a lot of fun just messing with the Titanic. And at the end of the video, I'm going to replace all the water in the ocean with boiling water. And I want to see what happens to the Titanic. Okay, so I made the depth of the ocean normal again. I just want to go back into those settings real quick because I saw something that looks really, really cool. If I go into this section, the tools section, I can change how strong the bombs are in this game. So if, I just want to see what happens when I put it all the way up. So if I put destroy radius and bomb blast radius all the way up and I hit apply now i'm gonna go back to my tools and i want to put a i don't know which bomb to do let's just go timer bomb i don't i don't know is this gonna absolutely destroy the titanic or is it not gonna be any different i don't know we're gonna find out here we go boys here we go oh holy nutcrackers oh my goodness that was three bombs that was three bombs right there. Wait, I just want to compare it real quick. So if I go back to settings and I put this back to kind of where it was, I think it was somewhere right around here and I hit apply. Now I want to put like one or two or three bombs. I want to compare guys because it was nowhere near that large of an explosion before. Wait, see, look at the difference. Look at the difference. That is craziness. Why didn't the middle one go off? Hey. Hey, why didn't the middle one go off? Well, you know what? Because you didn't go off, I have to put five of them now. Yeah, that's what you deserve, Titanic. You're putting my bombs out. I'm going to put five of them instead. Yeah, you thought an iceberg was bad. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. And then they add sad music. And I feel like I need to give a speech about the Titanic. I gave a speech last time. And I don't even have anything that I want to say about the Titanic anymore. But I'm going to talk like I'm giving an important speech even though I'm not saying anything at all. And that concludes my speech. Okay, I've been having way too much fun so far. Guys, if you want to see more Floating Sandbox on the channel, don't forget to smack that like button down low and give me ideas in the comments section, guys. Let me know what you think of this game and what you'd like me to do next. Okay, I want to go back to the settings. Let's see. We have Repair, Flood Radius. Okay, Ultraviolet Mode? Okay, I gotta try it. I have to try Ultraviolet Mode. I don't know what Ultraviolet Mode is, but I have to try it. Uh, what, what do I do? Is it going to make the ocean ultraviolet or is it going to make everything else ultraviolet? Let's put a, let's put an RC bomb here, 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 and here. Okay. I don't remember how to start these bombs. Do I hit enter? I don't remember how to start the bombs. Oh, son of a nutcracker. Is there a button that I'm supposed to press? Do I hit tab? I don't remember what to press, but I remember I had to press a button because it's a remote control bomb. That's what RC stands for. Oh, this is a load of barnacles. I can't remember how to set the RC bombs off. All right, so we have ultra violent mode on and we're just using these the regular bombs again. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to zoom out so I get a better look here. Ultra violent mode. Okay. Okay. I don't want to give another speech with the sad music, so I'm going to reload it right now. So ultraviolet mode, it seems like it kind of just affects these settings that I already did. Okay. I'm going to turn that off real quick and let's hit apply. Next thing we're going to do is with the wind. Like you can hear the wind in the background. I want to turn the wind all the way up. I'm going to turn wind gusts all the way up and I'm going to hit apply. Oh my goodness. Oh, 
I was going to say, I wonder if a wind gust could be enough to destroy the Titanic. And it just, it split the Titanic right in half in like a second. Look how fast the clouds are going by. Oh my gosh. Wait, I want to try that again. That was super fun. Let's reload. Let's see. Okay, this time it didn't split it in half right away. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. You know what? Let me turn that down because this is way too much. Uh, I don't even remember what the wind speed was at. Let's put it there and let's put this uh, there. I don't know. Apply. Okay, and then we're going to reload. You know what? You know what I'm learning from this game? The thing that I have learned from Floating Sandbox is that, you know what? The Titanic is not that strong of a ship. I mean, all it takes is a little gust of wind and the thing just split right in half. I mean, I know that was a major gust of wind. But now I'm starting to understand why the iceberg sunk the Titanic. Like, I feel bad saying that. But I mean, this thing gets destroyed from like a snap of the finger. Like if I blink too hard, if I sneeze near the Titanic, the thing will all fall apart and start sinking. So here's the other section. They have wind and they have waves here. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm putting the waves all the way to the max. I don't even know which one's which. I'm going to set all the waves up as high. Oh, <laughs> okay. That's just too ridiculous. That's just too ridiculous. Okay, we got to dial that back a little bit. <laughs> all right, all right. Calm down. Calm down, waves. Let's go back here. Let's dial this back. And, 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 apply. Oh, that's still really bad. That's still super wavy. I don't remember what they were set at. You know what? I'm going to put the waves all to zero. I'm going to put the waves to zero. Okay, and let's reset it. Sorry, Titanic. I mean, the Titanic's already died a million times. I want to do, I want to see how big of a tsunami I can make. So let's put the tsunami rate really high and let's make the rogue waves super high. I don't know what this is going to do, but we're going to try. It doesn't seem to be doing anything. Where's this tsunami that I was promised? What in the name of nutcrackers is this jargon? I mean, come on. I was promised a tsunami. Maybe I, maybe I need to put the waves up wave height. So what if I do that? Oh, okay. Okay. I'm starting to understand here. All right. Before we boil the ocean water, there's a couple more settings I see here. So like water density, I want to see what happens when we put it all the way up and all the way down. So if I hit okay, oh my goodness, it launched the Titanic into the sky. Holy nutcrackers. Wait, let's reset this one. And then will it just, no. Okay, I've just considered that at this point, anything will destroy the Titanic. It doesn't matter what it is. Now I turn the water density up, and it's still split in half. I mean, the Titanic's just a load of barnacles here. All right, let's put it all the way down now. I want to see what happens if I put the water density all the way down and then hit reset. Is it just going to sink to the bottom? Is that what's going to happen? Because there's no buoyancy at all because the water density's nothing? I mean, it destroyed the Titanic again. Look at this. I have destroyed the Titanic at least 15 times, and this video is only about 10 minutes long, maybe not even, depending on how long I edit. I mean, this is absolutely absurd. So let's put the water density back. I don't know, what was it at, like one? I think it was probably somewhere around one. Uh, and then let's reset this. Uh, there we go. Okay, there was one other thing. One other thing. If I go to, no, I don't want to go there. I don't even know what preferences does. I want to go here. Why is, like, why is it struggling now? I didn't even do any. Look at this. The thing's like already. Look at, listen to the sounds that it's making. I mean, the Titan. It's just made of. I think it's made of like paper mache. I don't even know what paper mache is. Okay. Uh, water craziness. Well, I mean, that just sounds fun. What happens when I turn water craziness up? No. Nothing. You're not going to give me anything. Water craziness? That sounds like such a fun setting to put up. Nothing? All right, well, because of that, I'm putting a bomb on all four of the smokestacks. Ready for it? We got a three. We got a two. We got a one. We got a... Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, that's what you get for promising me water craziness and then doing nothing. So everything, even a sneeze, will destroy the Titanic, but water craziness does nothing at all. I mean, that's just so absurd in my mind. What's the sound? Why did everything just start shaking? Why did I, oh, there's a tsunami warning. Oh no, <laughs> I didn't even do anything. I didn't even do anything. Why, why is there a tsunami warning? 
I mean, like I said before, if I sneeze on the Titanic, I think the thing will split in half. So what's going to happen when there's a, there's a, a tsunami? I can't even talk right now. I don't even see it. Oh, I see it now. Oh, you bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow I see it now. I mean, this thing is huge. We did the same thing in the last video. And it, it obliterated the Titanic. So I cannot wait to see what happens now. Let me put the wave speed up. If I go to wave speed, let's make it uh, right about a 2.75. So that should make the thing come faster. Let's make it even faster. I want to make it even faster. Wave speed, let's make it a 5.25. Is it moving faster? I mean, it's still not that fast. More speed. I want more speed. We're putting it up to 10. Yes, 10, because we really like the wind speed. Come on. I don't know if it's changing the speed of the tsunami or not. It seems like it's just the little ripples that are going faster. I don't know. It does, I think it is moving faster. Oh, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. All right. Three, two, one. It's going to just rip through the Titanic, isn't it? Oh, it's just like going through it. Oh, no. Here we go. Now it's launching it into the sky. Oh, this is phenomenal. Wait, wait, wait. I think there's a tool for, like, anti-flood, right? Anti-flood. Where's the anti-flood? I don't see it. Repair structure? We're trying to repair it. I don't think it's working. I'm trying to repair the ship. I'm doing my best. I was not an engineer in college. Forgive me for trying and failing miserably. Oh. I'm sorry, Titanic. What's this little piece? I'm going to try to repair this. Huh? Eh? Nope, that didn't seem to do anything. All right, and the Titanic's go. And there's another tsunami now. I hear it. I hear it rumbling. Where is it? There it is. Oh, that one's big. I think the two tsunamis hit each other. All right, let's 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 regain our composure here. Let's reload everything. Before I get started, I just want to go to load ships real quick because there's a million different things you could do in this game. Guys, I can't wait to make my next video. I'm already excited for my next video. I think I might finally ditch the Titanic. The Titanic has been fun, but I think I might start doing some of these other ones. Like, I see the Disney Dream Cruise Line. Uh, there's, like, there's planes. I think there's a bunch of different things in this game. I think there's the Grave Digger, like the monster truck, the Grave Digger in this game. There's a million different things that we can do in this game, and I cannot wait to do more in this game. Like I said, guys, help me out in the comments below. Let me know what you guys want to see me do. Wait, I can see the Titanic from the front? Wait, I just want to try this real quick. If I go here and then I want to cancel. Can I see the Titanic from the front? That sounds really cool, actually. Whoa! Okay, it's a little blurry. It's... Oh, no, it's a little lopsided, too. Wait, what? What? I didn't even do anything and it tipped over. Oh, come on! I didn't do a single thing and it just completely capsized. You know what, Titanic? I'm starting to think you're... you're, you're you know what? I'm just going to say it. The Titanic is a wimp. When they built the Titanic, they said that it was unsinkable. No one could sink the Titanic no matter what you do. And then on its first voyage, its maiden voyage, it hits a little ice cube in the water and the thing goes down. And now I spawn the thing in without doing anything and it tips over. All right, now is the moment you've all been waiting for. We're going to boil the water and see what happens to the Titanic. And I have a feeling the Titanic is probably going to fail miserably on this test because it's failed every other test that I put it through today. Uh, oh, we can do air temperature too. Wait, let me put the air temperature all the way up. I just want to see what happens there. Oh, it just burst into flames. Oh my goodness. I wonder how hot it is. Like, for something to just burst into flames like that, it's got to be like 800 degrees outside. This is absolute madness. Holy nutcrackers. I just kind of want to sit back and watch. I'm going to lean back in my chair. I just want to see what happens. I mean, are the smokestacks going to go down or are they going to stay up? This is craziness. And this was just the air temperature. Oh, I cannot wait to see what happens when we boil the water, guys. It's going to be fun to watch. Whoa. Oh, now we're getting like a big gust of wind, too, and it's making the, the fire spread. Okay, so it seems like it's mostly just taking out, like, the strings and the ropes and things like that for the Titanic. Most of it seems to be doing pretty well. I'm going to reset this real quick. And I'm going to put the air temperature back down to normal. Oh, no, it caught on fire again. I'm sorry, Titanic. I'm sorry, Titanic. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I know there's a fire extinguisher. Oh, this might take a long time. <laughs> this might take a really long time. 
I'm trying my hardest. Oh no, it's already collapsing. Come on. Eh, eh. Every time I put it out, it comes back. Every time I put the flames out, they just keep coming back. Oh, and now the wind's not helping me at all. Come on. Eh, eh. Oh. Ah. I think the more sounds you make, the more the fire extinguishers work. I think that's proven scientific fact. Eh. Oh. Ah. Is it working? I don't know. I don't, it's kind of working. It seems like most of the fire's out. But I can't get the back of it out. The back of it keeps coming back. That seems to be better. Okay, now we're gonna reset. We're gonna reload. And now I'm going to boil the water. So like you're making a pot of like pasta or if you're if you're boiling some mac and cheese, that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna fire up the burner. I'm gonna fire up the burner underneath the ocean. Like underneath the ocean right now, there is a, there is a gas stove right now that we're doing and it's getting warmer and it's getting warmer and it's getting warmer until it just all of a sudden goes, no, I do not want the wind to affect things. Are you ready? Boiling water, apply. Here we go, boys. I just wanna see what happens. Doesn't seem like anything's happening. Oh! Oh, it's actually melting! Oh my goodness! It's actually melting the Titanic! The water is on fire, it's so hot! I think this is beyond boiling water. This is like the next level of boiling water. And here comes the sad music again. Oh, the Titanic had a good run. And then we boiled it like a piece of fettuccine pasta and it just crumbled like a cheap lawn chair in the middle of the summer guys i will miss the titanic but don't worry because i could bring it back with one button that says reload ship. I'm gonna end the video there. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to smack that like button. If you are new to my channel, hit that subscriber button. We have a new video every day. I'm loving this game and I cannot wait to play more. Like I said, let me know in the comments if you guys have any new ideas for what I could do next. And I will see all of you in the next video.